Canada House was destroyed by a series of explosions, and an individual known to be part of the DedSec organization was seen on CCTV attempting to flee the area. SIRS new director of counterterrorism, Richard Malik, issued the following statement. I call upon my counterparts around the world to treat the DedSec threat with all due vigilance. They are not a resistance. What are they resisting? They are an international terrorist militia. And along with my counterparts in the Five Eyes Nations, I am building an... You get the idea. You're fucked. We're getting our butts kicked. Let's take the fight to him. Yes, I wouldn't recommend that. All scenarios show DedSec's odds of survival approaching zero before he can be found. Malik probably worked out the same thing. We had some thoughts about that, mate. Bagsy, bring it up, yeah? Done. The working theory is this. Blowing up a government building like Canada House would require bribes, an infiltration team, materiel, and so on. Doing it without leaving a paper trail would be impossible. Some of you nicknamed this paper trail the Malik Dossier. We're going to break into SRS headquarters, steal it, and prove Malik was behind the bombing. If we're lucky, we might even find some details on Zero Day. Your mission list has been updated. Hey, one more thing. I know Malik's currently our best lead on Zero Day and the bombings, but he's fucking dangerous. If you see him, don't try to take him alive. It's not worth it. On the contrary, I think what Malik knows about Zero Day and the bombings outweighs the well-being of any individual operative. Malik ought to be taken alive and interrogated. Central recruit for you. I'll mark them on your map. Public approval of SIRS shot up today following counter terror director Malik's statement that the Five Eyes nations will execute a coordinated global response to the DedSec threat. Mr. Malik, what is the service doing to protect the people of Britain right now? Well, we're aiming a little higher than just Britain. Soon we can know if anyone in any CTS using country in the world so much as utters the word DedSec. Thank you. SIRS advises citizens that positive discussions of the DedSec terrorist organization or their actions may result in investigation. a large explosion has occurred at the Canadian High Commission in Trafalgar Square. SIRS has issued a statement that the terrorist organization DedSec is active once again after months of relative silence. If you suspect anyone of being a member of DedSec, report them to SIRS immediately using your CSA app. Ready to go. What are we doing? We're here to find some documents we're calling the Malik Dossier. Basically, it's the paper trail that proves Malik was behind the Canada House bombings. Problem is, these documents won't be on one computer. They'll be on dozens, scattered across the country. So what do we do? Well, that's the million dollar question, isn't it? Let's have Malik take it. Surge uses a supercomputer called Filament to process information drawn from the CTOS network. It's like Noodle, if you could use it to search every document on every civilian, government or commercial device everywhere in the United Kingdom, instantly. Wicked Bagley. Break in and connect Bagley to a Filament administrative terminal. He'll do the rest. As usual.
order to access the filament admin terminal from your optic interface, you'll have to align the SIRS satellite network with my packet stream from Bloom Tower. stream myself into SIRS's nasty little snoop computer. Head to the basement and hack the filament admin terminal. There's an intruder in the building security systems. I don't... Sorry, channel is being hacked. I've taken control of building security. But I'd prefer to end this bloodlessly, if you're willing... That central server is Filament's admin terminal. Connect me to it to gain access. Drones. Wait, what? Microwave drones, one of Filament's novel intrusion countermeasures. They use little microwave cannons to selectively destroy compromised hardware, sort of like chemotherapy for computers. The server room automatically seals itself while they're deployed. What should I do? Try hijacking one of the microwave drones and use it to shoot the other ones down. will reset his connection and give us enough time to complete the intrusion, but Filament uses three quantum processors with independent power. We'll have to reboot each individually. Right. Power down, power up, the old on off. Close enough.
can you do something about this drone? It can't seem to take a fucking hint! immediately around the bomb were evacuated in an unscheduled drill. I have an email chain here between the facilities director and an anonymous SIRS account. Funny that didn't make the news. You think it's incriminating that I tried to minimize the loss of life? Come on, that's so spinnable, I'm motion sick. This microwave drone has been hanging around so long I've given her a name. I'd like you to meet Ada. Would you mind killing her? Redacted mission report for two SRS agents instructed to plant explosives as part of a training exercise, and it's signed and dated by the Home Secretary himself. Seems it's a bad day to be the Secretary. Exciting! Did you know that the head of security for Canada House had a daughter stuck in a Cairo jail, and that she was pardoned the week before the explosion? Why, he would certainly owe a very, very big favor to the SRS officer who pressured the Egyptians, wouldn't he? I suppose he would. Seems that Malik's given up having the microwave drones destroy compromised hardware. Now he's got them targeting you. The effect will be about the same, though. Straight from your own laptop, man. Case files on all these little side ops you've been running. Honestly, you might as well have titled this Evil Bomb Conspiracy, Doc Doc. That's enough. You can't do this. You mustn't do this. I won't allow it. Independent power has been rebooted. Return to the central core to complete the cycle. Wicked. Now let's get this asshole, yeah? With pleasure. with filament, and it seems Malik didn't quite have time to cover his tracks. I believe I can trace his position. Go. All right, let's find you. Too old, too young, too ugly, too female. Ah, there he is. Hello, Malik. You've been disconnected. Is it just me, or does he look constipated?
Right. Wouldn't be a briefcase wanker without his briefcase. Oh, look. Seems someone's locked the door on him. Don't worry. There's no way that's going to... Oh, no. It worked. Oi! What the hell, mate? Well, that's a wrinkle, isn't it? Is he seriously going to try to get away in a car? A car connected to the city-spanning network of automated surveillance devices? That I control. Auto drive now enabled. Fuck! Hello again. You know, for all your scheming, you don't exactly think quickly under pressure. Now what? I sent the Malik dossier to every media outlet from the GBB to the Aberystwyth Sheep Farmers Gazette. It may take some time to sort through, but it ought to clear Deadsec's name. At least for this particular thing. What about Malik? Made the mistake of getting into a self-driving car that owed me a favor. It's taking him to a secure location. Can someone explain why we aren't having that car drive straight into the river? Believe me, I'd love to. But he might be part of Zero Day. I just don't know how this all fits together, but we need to find out. You hear that, Malik? You're going to help us for real this time. Bloody hell, you insane robot! Slow down! Malik has been secured at the safe house. All right. Well, now that we have him, we should talk to him. Find out what he knows about Zero Day. Just don't get too close to him, all right? As long as he's alive, he's a threat. Okay, Malik. Tell us everything. We already know about the Canada house bombing and the earlier ones, too. The earlier bombings? What are you... Oh, God, I've been captured by morons. I didn't do those bombings. I tried to stop those bombings. I am a patriot, and they called me a crank. Even Emma. But that's when I knew that intelligence wasn't enough. To save the Empire, I would need power. And fast. What about Zero Day, huh? You knew about that before we talked? I'm a spy. So yes, I knew a few details about the biggest terrorist attack in recent memory. Truth to tell, I really did think Zero Day was you. That's just Occam's razor. But if you insist on a conspiracy, Albion stood the most to gain. Have you really not thought of this? You talk a good game, Malik, but not good enough to talk your way out of what you've done. You'll be staying here for a long time. Oh, I doubt I'll be here long. These walls will fall along with all of you soon enough. This radical cooperative you created is doomed to fail, like they all are. I've seen it a dozen times in a dozen places. You will tear yourselves apart. You won't even need Zero Day or Albion or whoever. A single unified ideology, a single strong leader. These have been the characteristics of power for all of human history. Democracy and pluralism were anomalies, blips on the timeline. That's what you are. Dead sec. A footnote in the history of the Empire. But now the page is turning, and you are not ready for what happens next. <laughs> 